And yeah, is this all according to plan? Excuse me, is this a restricted area? Metallo deciding to go after Lex. Well, he doesn't look too concerned. The door was unlocked. It's been a long time, Luthor. Not long enough. Why don't you come in, Mr. Corbin? Don't mind if I do. Can I help you? Sure. Keep real still while I remove your head from your shoulders. <laughs> Mercy? Not even if you beg for it. Not you, you fool. Her. What's Mercy got up her sleeve? Oh. Whoa! Clark's missing a doozy. Again. It's not enough. Yeah, you'd better run. <laughs> okay, Superman's here to save the day. Hey, Super Freak. What do you say to a rematch? I wouldn't miss it for the world. Care to step outside? Yeah, let's knock him outside. So he can't just... So he can't just kill Luther and Mercy. But, you know, we should be just be able to fly away and allow him to, and then come back, fight him, put him in prison. Luther, Mercy, they're both dead. Metallo's back in prison. It's the best ending, obviously. Come on, Superman. Let's finish this once and for all. But that's not an option, so... Oh, jeez. Okay, he is pretty swift. Yeah, allowing Metallo to... Completely annihilate Luther and Mercy is not an option. You like what we're doing to your office, so I guess we'll just have to save them as much as it pains me to do so. Okay, you know what? As we're fighting against Metallo, let's use metal against metal and whack him with this steel pole. And yeah, Metallo is actually pretty quick, able to propel himself around the room using kryptonite as some sort of jet. Okay, let's blast him a bunch. Run around in circles. Okay, he's really damn tough, and he's actually pretty swift. Propelling himself around the room. Kryptonite-fueled jet propulsion. But he's still got nothing on Superman. Not yet, at least. Unless he comes up with some sort of amazing attack. I'll just keep batting him around the room. Batter up! Round and round and round the room he goes. Where he stops, nobody knows. Yeah, I really hope you're watching this, Luther. And remember how easy... Well, not at the moment. But remember how easy it was for me to defeat Metallo. All your best laid plans, and they're just completely useless in the face of Superman. All the villains you fling my way, and I just fight my way through them like they were nothing. Remember this, Luther. Watch and remember. Oh no, you don't. Okay, let's try whacking him outside this room, just in case he decides to... Stop concentrating on me and go for Luther and Mercy instead. And yeah, rip their heads off. But no, actually, it's nice and easy. I think I'll defeat him in just a couple more seconds and it'll be done. Oop, unless he grabs a hold of me again. Yeah, Metallo, you need to use your kryptonite abilities a hell of a lot more. Because that's the best way to deal with me. Oh, there he goes. Let's take this somewhere. Oh, well, uh, the loading screen kind of cut him off there. Okay, so that's the end of the first stage, I guess. So maybe we are going to be taking this outside. Let's see. Oh, Lois, Jimmy. Don't get too close. Yeah, of course. Take a 
close to the auto factory. Do it! You can't do this! We're reporters! Well, now you're going to be the story instead of writing about it. Damn it, that last blast of kryptonite Luthor. weakened me a little bit. Ah, don't worry, Soups. We'll get him after this. It's more important we take care of Metallo. Oh, he's actually left Lois and Jimmy behind. Superman! Metallo's gone into the factory! I thought he'd, they'd be kept as hostages, but no, he just let them go. Okay, showdown in the auto factory. Oh, isn't this like one of the first places Superman ever fought Metallo? Alright, face off. Is that last part of his face gonna come off? That'd be pretty good. Nice wordplay there. Auto factory melee. Okay, Metallo, it's just you and me. No civilians, no time limit, nothing. Just a couple of super-powered guys throwing down. And it looks like Metallo may be trying to use more kryptonite-based tactics against me. Oh, damn. But it's okay. After so many years of fighting Metallo and other enemies all trying to use kryptonite against me. Oh. Oh! I accidentally slammed him into this trash compactor thing. I, I don't know, whatever it is. Let's do that again. Let's try doing that again. I would have had no idea about that if I hadn't have gotten so lucky. Oh. You have a pressing engagement. Wow, I'm getting lucky over and over and over again. So guess where you're going, huh? Guess where... Never mind. Come on. Ah, damn it. I was hoping the force of my blast would knock him in, but no. He's deciding to do something else. Okay, so he's using apocalyptic technology against me. Let's stop him. I'm not just going to stay down there like a sitting duck. Oh boy. If you go up onto another level and try shooting me from above, I'm going to come up to your level. And a wreck you. Okay, let's see about knocking you back down to ground level. Oh, I knocked him on top of a little pillar. Knocking him up higher and higher. It's all over, Metallo. Okay, slightly stuck between me and the wall there. Can't really knock him out of here. I'm just punching him. There we go. Against the wall. Alright, you know what? Let's uh, fly away a little bit. Give him an opportunity. Open wide, Superman. To at least try and fight against me. Deal with this, you pathetic worm. Well, you deal with this. Car to the face. <clears throat> now, he doesn't want to get off of there. He's content to just stay, so I'll have to knock him off myself. And, ooh. Okay, so now he's deciding to try something else. But we're not going to let him. Oh no, we're really not going to let him. Okay, th this might be mission complete. So we've just surrounded him in magma and it's... No. Now I'm really angry. Oh, yep, there we go. Face off. His face is off. It's gone forever. Yeah, I was thinking we now, encased him in all that magma as it solidified around him. But no. It just burnt off all of his flesh. So now he's full metal skeleton mode. Oh, well, there's something in my eye, too. Crazy heat vision. Yep, and we knock you into there again, grinding him up between all the gears. All right, it's pipe time. Hey, where are you going to, huh, buddy? Where are you going to? Ooh. See if you can stand up to my scrutiny, Superman. Oh yeah, I see. He's going full rampage mode. Sprinting around. Trying to duff me up. Throwing cars at my head. Well, it's not going to happen. Instead, you're just going to get piped. You're just going to get smashed into oblivion. Look into my eyes. 
and away you go. You should look where you're going. I've been told my eyes are my best feature. Ugh. Yeah, sorry, Metello. But if your entire plan for beating me was getting into it's a big old like fight, you to come here unprotected, I am always going to win. And I like how he's actually trash talking me whilst I'm beating the hell out of him. Ooh, I Get off of that car. I'm trying to lift it up and chuck it at you. There we go. Car to the face, more or less. It's not like you to come right. here unprotected. Let's get another pipe. As well as get him out of that corner as he tries to get back towards me. Or maybe he'll just try. I could beat you with my eyes closed, but I choose not to. Oh, you choose not to. Man, delusions or what? I'm beating the hell out of you. I'm winning with ease. But you're still trying to remain tough. Yeah, it doesn't matter what apocalyptic weapons you have in store. I'll still end up beating you. Oh yeah. Get out of here. Boom. Oh. Okay, let's go to that control panel then. Oh, poor Metallo. He's done. We've beaten the hell out of him. Didn't matter what he had up his sleeves. Apocalyptic technology, crazy weapons. We still beat him. Alright. So, let's see what actually happens to Metallo when he goes into that auto car builder or destroyer or whatever it is now i'm really angry i never knew you had such a magnetic personality metallo yeah try getting out of this Respect for machines, Superman. Oh, is this going to... No. Alright, for a second, I thought it was going to transform him into something even more powerful. No need to worry. Metallo's done. Once again. Talk about tough interviews. Nice work, Superman. You're always there when we need you, Superman. Just a matter of being in the right place at the right time, Jimmy. You've saved the city again, Superman. Don't you ever get any sleep? Not much. Alright, so back to Lex Tower as we go. Are we going to actually be able to pin this on him? I was considering redecorating anyway. Look familiar, Luthor? Any idea how it ended up in the hands of Metallo? Surely you aren't accusing me of orchestrating that metallic lunatic's escape, Superman. My lawyers would have something to say about that. What are you anyway, gonna... take a look around. You saw what happened at Lex Labs. One day you're going to slip on your own slime, Luthor. Tread carefully. I'll be watching you closely. But seriously, Luther, what, you're gonna try suing Superman for slander? I hate it when he does that. What are you looking at, Mercy? Ah, yes. Luther. And I shall be watching both of you closely. Very closely indeed, Superman. We'll pin everything on him one day. He'll finally get his just desserts. But, not today, as it's looking like this is the end of the game. Yeah, there we go. Title screen and credits? Yep. Well, Lex Luthor's not going to get his just desserts anytime soon, because, uh, well, this game never got a sequel. Yeah, that was a little bit abrupt. Um, I would have thought the 
supervillain boss battles would be a little bit more spaced out, and I definitely thought the Parasites one would be more of a challenge. But that was it. We've defeated Livewire, Parasite and Metallo. They're all going back to jail. The day is saved once again. And yeah, I'm, I'm actually kind of surprised that Metallo did just have his head taken off once again and he's no longer a threat. I, for a good few seconds, I definitely thought that the he would somehow integrate himself into the machinery and the fight would continue and it would become even more devastating, but, but no, he's done. So join me next time where we continue looking at the life of Superman. The next full game I'll be playing will be Superman, the Man of Steel. But just before that, I'll be making up my own little story using Injustice to introduce one or two specific, really damned important characters who don't have a really good Superman game to star in. Until then, leave me suggestions for superhero type games you'd like to see me play, and as always, bye for now. Oh, and I'll also put up a video of some sort of behind the scenes, how the game was made footage. And yeah, this was really good. It surprised me as I didn't know about it before and didn't think of it as one of the good Superman games. I can't believe this got such a low rating. Uh, the only reason I can think of for why that would be is for the time it came out, it might have been a little difficult to grasp the controls. Like, I can't think of any other PS2 games where you need to fly around like Superman is able to. Anyway, yeah, good game. Can't believe I didn't already know about it. Bye for now. Thank <laughs> you.